You've got magnificent bone structure. You do too. <laughs> magnificent bone structure. What makes bone structure magnificent or not, you know? It's holding all this. Good one. Hey, welcome back to you, me, and the movies. Tonight, we got a special request. Special request. From Granddaddy Marcus. Coming in hot. What are we watching tonight? Dead Calm. Cool. 1989 thriller starring uh, Nicole Kidman, Billy Zane, and Sam Neill. Cool, cool, cool. And Marcus says, oh boy. you loved him in Back to the Future 1 and 2, Titanic, and especially in Demon Night. I'm talking, of course, of the great Billy Zane. To celebrate your admiration for him, let's watch the 1989 vacation movie Dead Calm by Philip Noyce. Which one is Billy Zane in Back to the Future 1 and 2? He's one of uh, Biff's henchmen. Oh, okay. <laughs> right. And he's the bad guy in Titanic. Yeah, yep. And he's the bad mummy. guy in Demon Knight. In the mummy, he's the too. demon in Demon Knight. Is he in the mummy? No, he's not in the mummy. Well, he might be one of the... No, I don't think he is. Oh, no. Uh, I don't know. No. My favorite Billy Zane movie is Zoolander. He's one of Zoolander's good friends cool. at, at the parties he cool, goes cool. to. So. Also, Marcus's shout-out this month is for YouTuber Kawhi Games. He releases videos and does live streams of walkthroughs of the greatest retro and modern games around, which is great for people like me who don't have time for playing these games themselves. Nice. Yeah, nice. I should share my uh, retro gaming library with him. Absolutely. I have the complete North America collection of Sega Master System games. Oh, gosh. 114 plus games. Well, go give Quai Games a subscribe or a like or yeah. whatever. Check them go out. Go check them out. On YouTube. Mm-hmm. Well, should we jump in and... See what Dead Calm's all about? You Absolutely ready for first. Billy yeah. Zane on a boat movies? Absolutely first. Absolutely first. All right, yeah. You're all sorts of mixed up tonight. <laughs> it's the lack of sleep. But first, like, comment, subscribe. And if you feel like being like Marcus. Yeah, you can head over to our Patreon and maybe snag one of those special request slots. You also have early access, full income, and access to pulls helps people we watch next. Links down there. Check it out. Twitter and Instagram, if you have it, join us. If you don't, ignore us. And let's watch this thing. Yeah, let's watch this thing. Let's watch Dead Calm. Thanks, Marcus. A thriller on water. Hmm. So shark- I've never seen it, but I'm just going by what it looks like on the cover. Sharks or or is this like a event horizon sort of situation? <laughs> we'll have to find out does have Sam Neill in it. Dead calm. Maybe it's like triangle. Oh, nothing's like triangle. I feel like Billy Zane is in one of those like Egyptian movies or movies where he's like a pharaoh or like a why does that sound familiar? Anyone know what I'm talking about? It's got to be a movie you made me watch. He's in The Phantom. Oh, I, re- I remember The Phantom. Okay. But that's not the one I was thinking. Philip Noyce! He's in one of the Scorpion King movies. That's that's what it is, a Scorpion King? Haven't we watched one of those? No. Yes, we watched I'm one of those. I'm talking like one of the straight-to-video Scorpion King sequels he's in. He's not in any of the mummy movies. He kind of looks like the guy that plays a mummy, though. We watched a Scorpion King. No, we didn't. Yes, we, we did. Mummy 2 that has the Scorpion King in it. Oh, damn. I'll shut up and watch this movie. Okay. Merry Christmas, Captain Eager. Merry Christmas, Evan. Merry Christmas, sir. This is a Christmas movie? We should have watched this next month. It's like a period piece, too. Oh, Australia. Lay down. So it's not a period piece, it's just Australia. Where clothes look different in the 90s <laughs> or 80s or whatever. Who's he looking for? Uh oh. His wife was supposed to meet him and she's dead. Is that what you're getting? I think so. Most of the injuries were to the face, I'm afraid. 
Oh. Lisa said that that my son died on impact. Is that correct? Oh God. He was unconscious, Captain. He wouldn't have been aware of any pain. How long, Doctor? Twenty minutes. Oh jeez. I want you to talk to him. It's John Ray. Her eyes aren't dilating with the light. Rolled up the spell again. That's a funny one. Will you try it with mommy now? No. Oh, come on. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. Pretty young to be unbuckling himself. Show us that. <laughs> oh, Jesus. John, I could smell his hair. Stop, 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 stop. No, I can't. And when you're strong, then we'll go and we'll start again. No, she's never going to be able to get rid of that pain. Not ever. Dog barking at sunrise. Oh, look at that! First boat in three weeks. Watch this whole thing is just her unconsciousness when she's in the hospital. Mm -hmm. But look at her, eh? That boat's in trouble. How can you tell where to come from if it's in trouble? Maybe it's got to. SOS flag up. You just looked at it with binoculars. West, do you read me? Over. It's a ghost ship. I thought I saw something between here and the boat. What is it? A turtle? No, it's bigger. There it is. It's a dinghy. <laughs> a drift. No, there's a man in it. How'd she not see that? <laughs> <laughs> She's looking into the sun. It's probably coming to barter. Mm hmm. Get the fender down. So you're gonna have no face. Oh, okay. <laughs> Billy Zane. He's, he's got B Billy Zane's face. What the fuck? Doesn't even say hello. Just runs down below. What's your trouble, Mr. Warner? Tro trouble is she's going down. That's the trouble. She, she never last the morning. Has the water hit your engine? My engine, radio, the fucking bulkhead, galleys, everything. And yet, she still floats. How many people on board? Nobody. I'm alone. I'm it. He's already killed everyone else. He's crazy. So? It's Billy Zane. Yeah. Definitely crazy. Do not leave your wife with him. Listen to this. South Sea Island cruise. Four young women wanted for photo assignment must be attractive and broad-minded. That's creepy. So he took four women on his boat. There's six of them though. So who's the other? Couple of guys. I'm going on board. He's fast asleep. He won't even know. Get the gun. <laughs> oh, tennis balls in there. <laughs> what kind of dog wants a gun? It's a flare gun. What's he gonna find on that boat? Is it even going down? I don't know. Nothing good. My guess is this guy's like jumping from boat to boat, a taking pirate. out taking out. It's 
a big, big boat. It's a schooner. I don't know what that means. Looks like shit. Motherfucker. Not cool. Not cool. I was close. It scared the shit out of me. Is that just by luck or would he trigger something? I don't know. Why is he so sweaty? Because it's Australia. On the water, though. Better take that mermaid. Somebody was having fun with the mermaid sniffles. Ray, I'm sick. I gotta use the bathroom. Ray, I'm nauseated. Please. She's like, uh, I don't know what to do here. This feels so much like Event Horizon, just in a boat. Instead of on a... <laughs> well, do you think Sam Neill's actually the bad guy and there's... No. A portal to hell on this boat? No. <laughs> Did he chop him up? Probably. He's just a serial killer. And he's like, oh shit, my wife is on that fucking boat with this lunatic. The boat's definitely sinking now. All that water that was in that forward hatch. Oh, God. Get. Oh, fuck. Shit. Don't pray, jump! Oh, this is a short movie. He can catch him with the rower. They'll run out of gas. It's a, they're on a sailboat. There's no wind. It's dead calm. Yeah, but there probably will be wind at some point. He's a seaman. He can get that boat going. I hate the water. <laughs> like, how do you deal with all this electrical shit while you're submerged in water? Seems super dangerous. You're screwed, dude. Be sneaky. Where's John? You know, I was watching you when you were sleeping. Hmm, creep. And I gotta tell you that your face fascinates me. Yeah, he's a little crazy. You think? You've got magnificent bone structure.
You do too. Magnificent bone structure. What makes bone structure magnificent or not, you know? It's holding all this. Good one. There's no going back, Ray. No. No, don't say that. That boat is sinking. That's not my fault. There wasn't any food poisoning, was there? Well, it might have been. It just wasn't what killed them. <laughs> They tried to suck the light out of me, if you could possibly grasp that concept. Who were? Uh, all of them! They tried to suck the light out of me. You sound so much like them, Ray! It's scary! Now they were trying to kill me, do you understand? He's nailing this, right? Like, what? What, what is he thinking He's about? like Patrick Bateman. He's just gonna lock you in there now. Uh, he pumped for a long time. That means unplug a bunch of shit. <laughs> He's a proper salesman now. Salesman. Do you patch the holes, I wonder? Probably weren't even holes. The kid just didn't know how to... How to pump water out. Yeah. It's a stereo, man. It's a dog, dude. Can't do karate. <laughs> you can do karate all over my body. Is that his music? <laughs> it must be. <laughs> it's sinking, isn't it? No. You're not hurt, and no, the boat isn't sinking, is that right? Do you want me to stop the boat? Or at least slow it down. You'll be here soon, won't you? I mean, this guy clearly doesn't know how boats work very well, so just strip him. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. My eye looks like it's watering. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thought Nicole Kidman was really getting to you. Well, she gets to me. <laughs> you want my pillow? Not yet. Let's <laughs> wait for another bathing suit. Zane, I'll be alright. She just needs to, like, unplug a, a line to the thing. <laughs> To the thing? You know, the thing. The engine. <laughs> See? Yeah, the thing to the thing. Just connect the, the line to them the thingy. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Smooth. There a side hatch somewhere? Put it up your butt. <laughs> Jeez. He'll never look there. Well, he might. Really? It floats. Ben, no! <laughs> no, Ben! He's like, well, we need this. We need this to get out of here. Bring it here. Hey, Ben. Right there. He's gonna kill Ben. Hold the key, Ben. No, drop it. Keep it, boy. Over here, then. Come on. He's a good doggy. <laughs> good boy. He's a chair at this one. Oh. Jump, Ben. Up. Come on, climb. She should have been a little bit more smooth about it, right? I should have ate it. I mean, just have an excuse to cut her open. What you doing? I was gonna say fly swatter. Use a fly swatter. <laughs> Just... Friends. Don't fall for that shit. Just might need to say yes so it doesn't go unhinged. 
I don't know. The man on the edge capturing the base of death. But now, now taking on water again. S storm. Oh god, really? Uh oh, worst nightmares. This is what my nightmares are made of. Lovely. Is that the hull of the boat that's just completely destroyed? I think he was trying to see if there was a hole or like rotted wood anywhere that's leaking. John, can you hear me? <laughs> what are you doing? Honey, it is 9.15. You need to be in bed. Uh, you should water. be sleeping. I just want water. Okay, a little cup of it? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. okay. We'll get some. You sound like you're feeling better. Exactly. Like feeling better. <laughs> You gotta kill this fucker, right? I'm just wondering if he's in a storm and she doesn't seem like she is. Power's out. Which means engines are gone. John? Get to work, honey. John, do you read me? Get busy, honey. Yeah, they're in calm waters, so I'm. So he's either in the wrong spot, or um, or that boat is just got darkness attached to it, huh? Something. Yeah, that's unfortunate. If we were in this predicament, and I had to fuck him. To get you back. I don't think she's gonna... I think she's just seducing him to... Well, yeah, but if that's part of the seduction technique... Whatever you have to do to save me, babe. Okay. I just gotta know where it, where it stands, you know? Told you. <gasps> Welcome to Yumi and Nicole Kidman's ass. <laughs> and boobs. Good for her. She's gonna go get the gun. Come on back to you, me, and Billy Zane's ass. Friends, right? She's like, shit, I'm gonna actually have to have sex with this guy. Come on, Ben, go away. He's used to watching. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out, like, he's in the middle of the storm. Oh, no. I'm telling you, this is a death vessel. There's got to be another way out of there. Ouch. I guess they could be on the edge of that storm right there. Alright. <laughs> oh, 
a wing mo wet, a wing mo wet, a wing mo wet, a wing mo wet, a wing mo wet. Do you want it? I want. Thank you. <laughs> I better go and get dressed. Oh, until he's out. Fingers <laughs> crossed. No other way he's out like, of this This piece room? of shit vessel has to have some shitty wood in here somewhere. Jesus, Ray, couldn't have done been a little bit more smooth about it. <laughs> God, pass out already, dude. Ooh. Harpoon! How is he still going? Because it's just a sedative. It's not like... Uh -oh. She gave him like ten. I was I like three or four. I'd shoot him again. I mean, I would shoot again. That was Ben. That high? Oh, Making yeah, he open opens the doors. the doors. Poor Benny. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Pass out, dude. <sighs> Poor Ben. She's going to just stay on top for it. Seems dangerous, too. Well, she's got to get to her husband. Tie herself to the mast. Great Go timing. Fuel. Well, she's got wind. Good thing she knows what the fuck she's doing. She's been married to a salesman for how many years? <laughs> Stop calling him that. It's so embarrassing. Yeah, it's a hard job to do by yourself. Just a one-woman show. Should have tied him behind his back. I know. Hopefully her not work is good. Otherwise he can just untie himself or anything. Looks like we're snorkeling for a while. If there's a fish in there, you can get out. There's a hole. Fucking worst nightmare. Gonna light up the ocean or light his raft on fire. Light up the ocean. He's lighting up the whole boat. Signal fire. It's a pretty good signal fire. Crazy Pants has already probably found a way out. Okay. <laughs> 
Looks like he's whacking off. <laughs> yeah, we all have needs. Hopefully she's pointed right at where the fire was before it goes out. Yeah. Any chance she took the gun up up above with her? Don't make me do it. Stay there! I just wanna talk! She already made you harpoon your dog. Now you just made him mad. Well, he's stuck to the door now. Right through the fucking face. She's gonna throw him on the life preserver. Girl, what if you need that? It's all like a metaphor, right? Like he is death and she just kicked the shit out of death and sent him on his way while she returns back to her husband. She still think this is all in the hospital? I kind of think maybe. I could him be- lighting the boat on fire was him with the flashlight in the eyes? I could, I could completely be wrong, right? Call for him. And he's got to be beat from pumping, pumping that water. fucking water a whole day. They're not saying anything. She's got that tube in her mouth. She can't say anything. I don't know. <laughs> I'm probably completely wrong. <laughs> Boy, if it's not, what a missed opportunity, right? <laughs> the symbolism could all be linked like that. Yeah, that's true. The whole last scene of her flashing the light and him op- like seeing the light in his eyes. I'm like, oh, it's her. And want to take any chances that he's yeah, like underneath. Oh, yeah. He's <laughs> fucking. Oh my god, you gotta be shitting me. I mean, he's still on the boat? Uh, yeah. Where's he hiding? Like an engine room or something. Coffee and a croissant. Oh God. You know what I'd love for lunch? John, you got the tap. Hell of a shot. Him right in the mouth. That breathing's creepy. That score's been like that all the time. Has it? Yeah. Uh. Every time there is, the, he was chasing her. Creepy. All right. Dead calm. Yeah. It was pretty good. It was good. Very much a thriller. Mm-hmm. Three stars on the boat. That's all the movie was. Yeah. There's really nobody else in it. Other than yeah. a couple yeah. extras there at the beginning. Mm-hmm. But yeah. Her, I was wrong about her. Her like coma. There's a deleted scene that she wakes up at the end. <gasps>
Could be. Yeah. No, I think the symbolism of that last scene of her finding him in the dark with the light was kind of like him saying her name and finding her with the light after yeah. the accident. So, yeah, that was pretty good. And uh, Billy Zane knocking it out of the park, being Holy crazy. Creepy as shit. Yeah. Right? Yeah. He killed that performance. Mm-hmm. And this was early in uh, Nicole Kidman's career. Yeah, she looked very so, young. Yeah, 1989. So I think this might have been around, what, Days of Thunder was about that time, Sounds too. Sounds about right, yeah. So, yeah, she was just getting started. It's Sam Neill. He's always good. Playing a good guy mm-hmm. this time. I like it when he plays good rather than yeah, bad. rather than creepy. He plays them both well, though. Yeah, he's just a good all-around actor. So. He is, Sam. But yeah, great performances from all of them. Mm-hmm. And a uh, great little thriller at sea. Her fighting him off on the boat while he's trying to keep his sh- ship afloat to she try really to get back She should have killed him. Yeah. This just all comes back to if you're in a position where you have to kill or be killed, don't show mercy. Don't show mercy. <laughs> there Is you that go. horrible? <laughs> Merciless right here. No mercy. <laughs> definitely a Spartan woman. Kill or be killed. You fucking kill. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Put them on a life raft and they go back for him. Definitely don't go back. Yeah. Oof. Somebody else would have found him. Maybe not. I was kind of thinking that the boat that was shown up to the life raft was some other boat. And it was like starting another cycle, but it was their boat. Yeah. So I was like, I thought that's how it was going to end with some other couple finding Billy Zane on a life raft and being like, what happened? And he's like, oh, my boat sank, blah, blah, blah. And then he'd leave it. Right. Cliffhanger of he's still out there. Killing people, right? Or at least keep a safe distance from the life raft and, like, shoot him with the fucking yeah. flare from a distance. So he definitely saw them coming, dove under, waited until they were right next to it, and then swam under the boat yeah. and climbed up to the other side. Yeah, so, exactly. And hidden a little cubby hole until... And when you're a creepy survivor, of course, what else do you do? Yeah. All right. That was pretty good. It was very good, yeah. yeah. What was the most tense moment? For me, when he had to dive under the boat... And hold his breath. Uh, yeah, and, hold his breath for that out. long. That was the most tense moment. Yeah. How stupid. You just hate holding your breath. I can't. Oh, I just, the thought of it panics me. You would have lasted 10 seconds and like, oh, you wouldn't even have gotten to no. that. Nope. Underneath part. My lung capacity is so weak. I would never. <laughs> like, well, I know you uh, can, like, build it. And I know, like, you can, like, hy- yeah. I'm sure hyperventilate yourself. His training to, from but, the Australian no. Navy was like. They have to hold their breath for two minutes. One would think that track, he'd be very good at like it, that, right? but he wasn't getting a lot of oxygen through that fucking tube. Couldn't yeah. have been. Well, snorkel. So. With wires through it and bugs. And he's... Well, he blew everything out. Still. Started off, but yeah. Gives me anxiety. That whole part with the gun was pretty tense. I'm really annoyed with her for not S- Like grabbing the gun and loading it and then you're like... Running right into him. Yeah, yeah, just running right around the corner with a gun in your hand, dumb dumb. Yeah, all right. Like, wait till he is incapacitated or sneak. Yeah, she up had on all that time because he was sedated at that point. Just waited out. Mm-hmm. Right. She what clearly didn't give him enough. Yeah. All right. Well, what should people comment on after dead calm? Most intense moment for you. Yeah. And. uh Give us uh, some other movies that you like with all these three actors in them. Not that star all three, but I like, say, I doubt like what's there's your favorite Billy movie. Zane movie? What's your favorite Sam Neill movie? And what's your favorite, favorite Nicole, Nicole Kid- Kidman, Kidman mm-hmm. movie? Yeah, right? that sounds like a great one. Yeah. Also, like, comment, subscribe. And thank Marcus for picking this movie because it was a fantastic movie. Yeah, it was a good one. Good tense. Thriller. I might watch it again. Yeah. I mean, not tonight, but at some point. Well, yeah, you don't have to watch it again tonight. Like, if this was a movie that came on TV, you definitely watch, watch it. Again. it. All right. Well, yeah. Well, if you want to be like Marcus, check out our Patreon link down below. You can get early access to our videos, full-length commentary, access to polls, helps people watch next. Or, if you're lucky, snag one of those special request slots. Check it out. Link's down below. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.